Anything, whatever. A dollar for a mall. Would you take 40 if I bought all your cars? Basically like live action Mario Kart. Oh, so interesting. Download the Switch game. Morning, how are you? Good. BMW Car Club magazine. Yeah, I used to have an M3 CS. Oh, yeah? Yeah. 2019. What are you asking for these? Um, just anything, whatever. A dollar for a mall. Sold. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta get rid of stuff at this point, right? Yes. You want a box? That's like sold. Or a bag would be fine. That's Either like, one, it doesn't matter. They are like sold. 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 Thank you so much. Okay. These are a little bit better. Have okay. a good day, thank you. Oh, is that for bags? No, I don't think so. Oh, wait, actually, yeah. Gosh, look who it is. Fiona. Can we get it? Mm, I'm good. <laughs> You're good. How are you? Good. Good. Um, we're going to get all these little pieces right here. We'll keep looking around and see what else we can find. Oh, that's what you have, isn't it? That's funny. Oh, maybe. Bunch of Lego. I owe you uh, 17. Thank you. You have a little bag I can put some of these in? Yep. Thank you so much. Good luck with the sale. Thank you. Morning. Would you take 40 if I bought all your cars? Um, I think we were at 50. For yeah, 50. 50? I'll do 50. Do your Roombas work? Yeah. Uh, that one is missing the side, the little sweeper brush that brings it on, onto the inside. Gotcha. But they both work. We just have four animals so yeah those things can't keep up right Daddy, sweeper brush yeah a lot of stuffies the one i was saying the sweeper brush if you uh like look at this one how this has got the brush here. oh yeah i see yeah so that that it's replaceable i believe i just they're not yeah see, i mean they both turned on when we flipped them over uh-oh don't start I thought it was going to start back at me. It start, starts running yeah. over the tables. Um, I'll take this one. So I owe you 60 bucks. Okay. There you go. Thank you. Yeah, not a problem. You want to take the money, buddy? You're probably some of the Christmas train thing. Oh, that's cool. Darcy, come look what Papa found. Pretty neat, huh? It is so cool. Did you never open that? No, it's been opened. It's just I put it. We put it around the Christmas tree. Yeah. And I pack it and put it back up afterwards. You did a great job packing it. Yeah, the Chris. I'm particular about opening stuff. Yeah. Uh, but Sounds the, like the trust no <laughs> Right. The, the tree no is too it. big. Oh, okay. And it's on carpet, so it gotcha. doesn't necessarily run the best on carpet with the animals running around yeah that makes sense but it works uh it 
has all the pieces in there. I think there's one piece of track where a tab is broken off. Uh huh. Yeah, I'll buy that too. Okay. And I mean, you can here button up here on the. Oh, that's cool. There you go. Thank you. Awesome. Morning. Good morning. How are you guys doing? Doing good. How are you? Good. Oh. Yeah, it's a little chilly this morning. Whoa, it's a match game. That's neat. It does not come with the switch. Gotcha. Have you seen that before? I haven't. That's cool, though. Okay, so it's basically like live action Mario Kart. Oh, so you interesting. Download the Switch game. Yeah. It's got um, the car in there. The car has a camera. You no way. Your, yeah. You set up your track. And so you can race around your house, but it's just like real Mario Kart, like that it pops up the boxes and all of that stuff on the screen. Oh, that's so, so if cool. you get hit with like a turtle shell, it'll yeah. stop your car. That's wild. Yeah, it's really fun. Huh. We bought them during COVID to keep my kid entertained. Sure, yeah. Daddy, you got two more quarters? I think so. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. That's for the uh, ink. Would you do 10 on the pen? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Good luck with the sale. Thank you. Back at the house, found a lot of really good stuff at the garage sales today. Got this Mickey Mouse Holiday Express. Dad actually found this. I was messing with these model cars and the Roomba. Dad was on the other side of the garage. I was like, hey, they got this for 10 bucks. And everything's pretty much intact. He said that they did use it. It's got one little broken piece on the track, but he put everything in there nice and clean. Um, it's selling for about 25 or 30 bucks, but I think Dad's going to keep it and just have it around his tree when the uh, kids come over for Christmas. I got these model kits. There's a total of eight of them. Um, they're asking 10 a piece. I got them all for 50 bucks, and they're selling between 20 to 25 each. The great thing is they're all sealed in the plastic. Sometimes I'll buy these and open them up, and like the pieces are kind of loose inside, and they almost never are complete when that's the case. But since these were sealed, I went ahead and picked them up. These are nice because they're easy to list, easy to ship. Probably not going to get rich on any of these, but definitely some money to be made. Got this Tech Boss Intelligent 3D pen. Uh, 3D pen. It is new sealed. It still has the uh, stickers on the outside. That's never been opened. I paid ten. That's going for about forty. Got some Brother Ink at one sale. This is uh, genuine OEM Brother Ink. I noticed uh, this one has been opened, which is unfortunate. It does still have this orange piece. That's what uh, keeps the ink sealed. But the fact that it's open might just totally kill the value. Uh, but this black one by itself is going for right around like 15 to 20 bucks. Got a big tub of Legos at one sale. I paid uh, $7.50 for it. I was hoping there was going to be some minifigures in it, and lo and behold, there were. I got it back, dumped it all, and went through and found the minifigures. We got a little eraser head guy. Um, it looks like there's a bunch from the Lego movie. I'm guessing what that's what the Joker and Batman and this little guy is. Um, I feel like this might be from Lego movie too. I can't remember. I'll do a quick look up on these to see if any of them are worth listing individually. My guess is probably not. Uh, but these are really easy to do um, auction lots. So I might just do one big auction lot, start it at a buck. These fit my criteria of what I'll do an auction for. I'll auction an eBay item if it's kind of tricky to find out an exact value and if there's a big demand. There's definitely a big demand for uh, the minifigures. I've done well, um, you know, selling them in lots before. You'll average a dollar to two dollars each, uh, maybe a little bit more depending on what's in the lots uh, when you uh, auction off the minifigures. Then the Legos themselves, I mean, there's probably five pounds here, so I can bulk those up and maybe sell them local. This Roomba is the model 650. Whenever you're looking at Roombas, the models will always be on the bottom. So this one you see right here is 650. It is pretty dirty, needs cleaned up. Uh, I paid 10 bucks for it, it's going between 40 and 50. But yeah, if you can get a working Roomba for cheap, I'd say pick it up. They generally sell pretty fast. Got this wrestling belt for $2. I'm not sure there's a lot of value there, but my buddy's son's big into wrestling, so I'll probably just give that to him. Um, the Snow White Snow Globe. I can't remember what I paid. Oh, there you go. $3. Um, that's going for about $20. And then I got these uh, DC Comic Bobbleheads. These are interesting because they're made by Funko back in 2012. Funko started with bobbleheads before they were making the pops. Um, dollar each. I might just lot them all up and try to get 25 or 30 bucks. Last thing I got was this huge lot of uh, BMW Car Club magazines. 
I think there's probably like 30 of them in here. I paid a dollar for all of them. Magazines can be a pain. Um, I only recommend getting magazines if you can get them for next to nothing. <laughs> and if it's generally all the same magazine, like this is all just going to be one big lot of uh, BMW Car Club. I think they'll sell. It'll probably just take a little bit of time, but I think I'll probably get $30 plus shipping for them. And uh, word of the wise, you cannot ship magazines media mail because they had advertisements in them. So that disqualifies them for media mail. Typically, a flat rate box is a good way to go. But yeah, happy to get those for a buck. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.